Welcome to footballgameplan.com where football makes sense. I'm Emory Hunt, the czar of the playbook, breaking down the Belk Bowl between Louisville and North Carolina State. Now let's start with the Cardinals, keys to victory to see what they can do to come away with a bowl win. You have to like what Charlie Strong has done with their Louisville football team. They're led behind freshman quarterback Teddy Bridgewater. They have to get him involved in the game early, get him in an early groove with those short to intermediate passes. That's going to open up everything else later on in the ball game, and he's going to get comfortable. Now, defensively, they have to make North Carolina State one-dimensional. You want to put all the emphasis on that ground game, and that's going to unleash that pass rush that Louisville has. That's one reason why they've been able to make a run toward a bowl game this year. Their defense is very aggressive, but the question I have back to their offense is can that offensive line hold up versus the pressure of the Wolfpack? North Carolina State does a great job in creating pressure and getting to the QB. If that offensive line, which has been leaky all season, can't hold up, it could be a long day for the Cardinals. Let's look at the Wolfpack's keys to victory to see what they can do to come in and get a nice bowl victory. I look at the Wolfpack coming to this ball game with an outstanding quarterback prospect in Mike Glenn and one of the top pro prospects going into 2013. I'm amazing quarterback, but they have to establish the run. They have to come in and force that pressure of Louisville to hold their own in the run game. Teams like Louisville just want to load that box and get after the QB and cause a lot of pressure but if they have to worry about the run that's where North Carolina State can have an advantage as up to James Washington and coming to get that ground game going and the number two receiver has to step up you have to take some pressure off TJ Graham the outstanding wideout he can't be the brunt of the focus of the offensive passing attack so other wide receivers and not just the running backs but receivers in general have to step up and help that guy out now defensively you have an all-american corner and david amerson 11 interceptions when a guy like that is going against a freshman qb you have to bait teddy bridgewater and give him different looks sucker him into certain throws that way you can come away with some interceptions to get the ball back for that offense I'm going with Louisville in this ball game. I like the way the defense has been opportunistic. They're getting that ball back for that offense. Teddy Bridgewater has been protecting the football, and they're operating off a lot of balance, and that defense is going to be able to stay aggressive and get after Glennon and cause a lot of havoc for that Wolfpack offense. For more college football previews, visit footballgameplan.com slash college football or visit our YouTube channel at youtube.com slash footballgameplan. Follow me on Twitter, guys, at fballgameplan. And listen to the Football Game Plan Radio Show, which airs every Saturday, 11 a.m. Eastern Time at blocktalkradio.com slash football game plan.